In this video, I'm going to show you how you can edit your Google Slides with your smartphone easily. Hi, this is Neotan. Now, first of all, please go ahead and download Google Slides. So first, you might want to go to your App Store for iPhone users and Android users, you may want to go to your Google Play Store. So I'm going to go to my App Store and I'm going to search for Google Slides. As you can see over here, install it and then you go ahead and open it. All right, now once you open it, you will see something like this. Welcome to Google Slides. Tap the plus icon to create a new presentation. So I'm going to tap on this plus icon on the bottom right corner. Tap on that and you can see you can choose a template or create a new presentation. So for this case, I'm going to choose a template. I'm going to tap on that. And here you can see a list of templates that you can choose from. So right now I'm going to go to under this work category and I'm going to choose consulting proposal presentation slide. So I'm going to choose this template. Now once you choose the template, you will be directed to this page. So here you can actually edit all these slides all right, again, it's not really in your mobile phone. All right, next, you will be directed to this page. So you can see that there are about 20 slides. As you can see, when I scroll, you can see there's a top right corner here. You can see there are 20 slides. Okay, so you can edit each and every one of them. So I'm going to go to the first one. And you just want to double tap on it. Okay, double tap. All right, and now you can see at the bottom, at the bottom here, you can see there are 20 slides. So you can always add new slides if you want. You can just edit, just press it. And here you can choose any of these templates here. So I'm not going to add right now. You can edit and you can edit it. So now I'm going to show you how to edit it. So let me go back to the first slide here. First one. And here you can tap on the text. Now just tap on the text. And you can see you can change it. Alright, just double tap it. And I'm going to change to business proposal. Okay. And you can zoom in if you want. So you have to use two of your finger like this and just zoom in. Okay, just open it like this zoom it so you zoom it like this and then you just tap double tap to edit it so i'm going to edit all this i'm going to move this all right i'm just going to key in business proposal for company 101 next now if you want to change the color of the text the font and you want to bolt it let me go ahead and double tap this company word and here you can see the a icon here you can just tap on that and you can change the color you see that you can change to any of this color. I'm going to choose this brand color here. Let me change this to the brand color. For company, perhaps. Perhaps you're going to highlight all these words here. From business proposal for company. I'm going to change this to black. And let's change to black. And you can see it is black. And one oh my next is the brand color. So let me just go and show you what else we can do with it. Okay, let's say if you want to underline it. Okay, you can see underline. Which is the U icon. Just tap on that to underline it. If you don't want it, you can just... Tap on underline again to undo it. And here you can see the B, which is bold. You can bold the text if you want. Bold, unbold. Bold, unbold. And you can highlight the text as well. Just tap on the highlight highlighter icon. Here you can choose. As an example, I'm going to use yellow. Okay, let me just show you. You see that? Okay, this is how you can highlight the text as well. Now I'm going to not going to. Uh, let's say if I want to undo it, I can just tap on this back arrow key here on the top left corner here. Just tap on that back arrow key to undo it. See? So if you did something wrong or a mistake, you can just tap on the back arrow key to undo it. Okay, now next, I'm going to show you how to add an image into your presentation slides. Now, first of all, go ahead and tap on this plus icon here. Tap on that. And you can see there is a pop-up menu from the bottom. So here, you can select whether you want to insert a table, line, shape, image, text and comment. Now I'm going to upload a, a, an image. So let's tap on image. Okay, you can choose from the photos or from the cameras. So I'm going to tap on uh, from photos. So that's where I'm going to find all the images, photos that is inside my uh, phone library. This is where you're going to use your camera and directly capture a picture directly into your phone. Okay, so here I have three images that is inside this album. So let's say I'm going to use this example. I'm going to edit. And you see, the image appear. Okay, so this is how you actually insert your image. You can drag it, you can make it smaller. All right, now let's say if you want to move this image to the second slide, all you're gonna do is just tap on it and hold it. Hold it, and then you're going to drag it and move it to slide number two. 
all right don't let it go just hold it don't let it go until you come to the slide number two and now here you can let it go like this okay so this is how you move your image from slide number one to number two by just tap on the image hold it until you move to slide number two and then you let it go okay now if you want to delete this image you can just tap on it and you can see there's a delete button you can delete otherwise you can copy it or cut it or paste it so i'm going to delete this now let's say i've already done all the presentation slide okay i've done the edit i've beautified it i've designed it i've done it everything now let's say if you want to beautify it you want to make it look more beautiful more professional you can actually go to another app what we call canva okay so you go to canva you can actually look for slides or you can just key in presentation for my case i'm going to just key in slides as a keyword and then here you can see the list of all the slides presentation templates okay they are looks very nice you can see so let's say i'm going to use this business marketing i'm going to tap on that and you can see canva also have their own template design which is very nice from slide number one all the way to slide number 10 so there are 10 pages so there are a lot of other templates so it depends on your preferences okay there are plenty of them compared to google slides so google slides the templates are very limited compared to canva okay now let's say if i want to export this presentation slide all i got to do is i just tap on these three little dots here you can see on the top right corner tap on that here you can see share and export so let us tap on that here you can copy the link so you can share this link to your colleagues or to your boss or to anyone else so you can just copy the link and you can just share it okay now let's say if you want to download it you can save as a powerpoint you see that you can save as a powerpoint or you can manage access or you can share with someone else by inserting the email address okay like this all right you can insert the email address your colleague email address or your customers email address so that you can share this presentation slide to them so usually for this case i will just copy the link and i will just send them the link and they can actually just come to this presentation and just view it so i hope this is helpful for you now if you have any question please leave your questions in the comment down below of this video go ahead and i'll try to reply to you as soon as possible or i will actually create a video just to answer your questions all right so this is all for this uh, video tutorial so this is 101 and i'll see you in the next one